Hello and welcome back to another video. And this video is all about Row Company Season 4. So grab your favorite drink and snack and do not go anywhere. And let's jump into it. With Season 3 coming to an end, it's time to look ahead to Rogue Company Season 4. But if you are new to Rogue or an existing player and you want to see my opinion, I have reviewed the entirety of Rogue Company Season 3. And you can check that video out right now by clicking the banner up above. But now, enough of Season 3. Let's talk Season 4. And starting off with Ranked. There was no mention of any changes for ranked gameplay in the Sinister Shadows update that took place last Thursday. However, if there's one thing that they immediately need to fix, it's the ability to lose RP for losing the game of ranked demolition. Now in season two, the system worked perfectly where you played your 10 placement matches and then you'll get placed in either bronze, silver, gold, plat, or in some cases diamond and then you grinded out the remainder of your games to try and get rogue rank now what's happened in season three is that you don't lose rp and you can't get demoted so if you're placed in gold and you lose 50 games you wouldn't see yourself in bronze in fact you'll still be in gold which let's face it it's not competitive and it kind of sucks. So one of the immediate improvements that needs to happen for season four is the ability to get demoted again. My second point is about the rewards for grinding out 40, 50 hours of ranked gameplay. Now it's fair to say in the previous seasons, the rewards for grinding out so many hours have been a little bit subpar. And as you can see, in Season 0, I got an Avatar. And Seasons 1 and 2, I got a Banner. Now, I feel like if this was advertised at the start of the season, I'd probably be less inclined to grind out ranked. However, I do feel like they can improve their system by having clear set rewards for how people finish in each tier. So if you finish in Bronze, you might be unlock a Rare Banner. If you finish in Silver, you'll get the Rare Banner and, say, a Weapon Wrap gold you'll get the rare banner weapon wrap and say a brand new skin and so on and so forth all the way up to rogue rank now the last idea i have for ranked in particular that could come in future updates is limiting the amount of players that can actually achieve it so you only have say the top five percent of the player base that can achieve rogue at any one point and you fall out of rogue if you're not playing that often. Therefore, people that want to know be known as the best players in the game, they have to come back and fight for their place. Now, that's enough of ranked. I wanted to talk season four and the actual launch of season four. And hopefully it goes as smooth as possible without any bugs and new issues that are implemented into the season. Um, because I do feel, again, this might deter players away. And it is my big fear that this could happen. Um, we see that with the cannon update. And, it, yeah, it kind of ruined players' experiences. But all the loyal players have stuck by Rogue Company. So I can only hope that, fingers crossed, it goes as smoothly as possible. Just another thing to touch on. And I hope they kind of implement in Season 4. But I've seen a lot of players complain about the individual customization for Rogues. Whereby you are restricted to having one camo for a particular gun across every rogue that can use it. And to come up with some insane style and customization combos, that has been taken away from you. So I do really hope they're working in the background to get that back. Um, because I, for one, definitely really enjoy the cosmetics and the ability to customize your rogues individually. Now, the Battle Pass of Season 4 does bolster some of the best cosmetics that Rogue Company has ever seen to date. So, if you want to see the Season 4 Battle Pass before it comes out, then please do click the banner up above and check out the Battle Pass right now. Now, lastly, I do hope that Rogue Company Season 4 is the best season that Rogue Company have ever ever produced and they've got lots of surprises that will unravel throughout the season and if you're super excited for season four and you want to see some exclusive footage of the brand new map wanted then check this video out here until the next one peace